Recently, I talked with Michael Bolton about how he struggled as an artist and musician for 20 years before he had a hit. And during that time, he was also trying to raise three children. He said it was hard. He and his family got eviction notices and they fought to keep it all together. He also told me that when he found success, he knew he had to find a way to give back. And he is with a program called Beyond Trauma. It's helping kids heal and find new hope through music. When you're like feeling stressed or like the class is like a little bit worked up, you get really lost into like playing and it just like gets you like in a better place. For Kiara Moore, the journey to that better place begins in this little music room at New Horizons School in New Haven. It's part of the Michael Bolton Charities music therapy program called Beyond Trauma. It's given them a way to express themselves, what they've seen, what they feel, a way out, and it gives them this positive perspective on life that they did not have. Some students have been victims of domestic violence. Others have witnessed violence or experienced some kind of trauma, loss, or grief. When we're talking about domestic violence <clears throat> and people growing up and living around extreme violence, it is a very serious form of post-traumatic stress disorder. Music is allowing these kids to, to become engaged because it allows them to speak in a way that they have never been able to. Music is powerful and it's flexible so that I can meet the kids wherever they are. Some kids will share things they've never shared before. It changed a lot for me because before I used to just be mad about it. Not mad about anything but I get fired up and then she'd be like, come play some music. And I'd just come in here, play some music. And then by the time I leave, I forget like what I was mad about. With some kids, we'll do a lot of playing and not as much talking. And we'll look at the feeling sheet at the end of the time. So they learn to identify their feelings. And then they can see, wow, I can change what's going on with me. Music therapist Sid Slaughteroff says some students sing and others learn to play instruments or write and perform raps. <laughs> But whatever the format, it all promotes healing, happiness, and hope. There is great hope, and there are great efforts being made, and now there are great breakthroughs that we're excited about. This program did a lot for me. I've been mean, days I come in here more than mad. I play keyboard, I leave like nothing wrong with me. I guess that's just power of music. And Bolton told me that his charity is also working to create a family justice center in New Haven to offer support, shelter, counseling, and legal help to victims of domestic violence. For more on those efforts and the music therapy program, you can just head to our website or our Fox 61 News app and look for the Hope tab. America Arias, Fox 61 News.